huge help for us having a dip and uh, having guys that's been here in the past and come back within a week notice and, and plug and play and steal another playbook. So we've uh, missed what we had to do. Injuries are part of the game. How much is noise a problem for you for where you are, especially in a place like this that's probably as noisy as it's going to get, right? Yeah. I mean, uh, crowd noise is always the home team's advantage. That's why you always try to fight for home field uh, for the playoffs. Uh, I think we'll be able to handle it. We've uh, been in a lot of environments before. Uh, so, you know, this week of practice, sim simulating the noise and getting our communication, non-verbal communication together, so we'll be, we'll be ready for that. Does it get to the point where you cannot hear Drew Brees? Uh, sometimes. Sometimes. I've been in a few games where I couldn't hear him in Seattle, and, uh, Kansas City. So some lip reading and uh, some, some signals as part of it. Uh, how much do do coaches or do you as an offense like that balance? I know Carolina really loaded up stop the run, but how much better is the offense when there is balance? I mean, it's great. I mean, they, they work together. Um, when you can run the ball effectively, you get more guys in the box and you get them over the top. I mean, you throw the ball effectively, you, get, you know, those safeties back up, corners back up. So they work together. They work together. I mean, uh, the really good defenses will try to make you one-dimensional. And then... Uh, try to defend it, defend it like that, but we're uh, fortunate enough that we have the running backs we have and that we have a Hall of Fame quarterback.